cooling it down, America's chilling resistance to UHT pasteurization. In the era of climate consciousness and environmental urgency, every aspect of modern life is under scrutiny for its ecological impact. Yet amidst the fervor for sustainability, there's a frosty resistance lingering in America's dairy aisles. While the rest of the world embraces UHT, ultra-high temperature pasteurization as a greener, more energy-efficient solution for milk preservation, America clings to the cold embrace of refrigeration. In this examination, we delve into the paradoxical persistence of refrigerated milk in the face of a warming planet and explore why UHT pasteurization might just hold the key to a cooler, greener future for America's dairy industry. Cold Comforts – The Allure of Refrigeration in American Dairy Culture In the realm of American dairy culture, refrigeration has become more than just a means of preservation. It's a symbol of modernity, freshness, and consumer choice. From the moment milk is harvested from the udder to the point it reaches consumers' hands, the expectation of crisp, chilled refreshment reigns supreme. Refrigeration isn't merely a convenience, but an ingrained expectation, a testament to the pervasive influence of consumer culture. The allure of refrigerated milk traces its roots back to the early 20th century, when advancements in refrigeration technology transformed the dairy industry. Prior to widespread refrigeration, milk delivery services relied on insulated containers filled with ice to keep milk cool during transport, a labor-intensive and costly endeavor. The advent of mechanical refrigeration revolutionized the way milk was stored and distributed, paving the way for the rise of the modern dairy aisle. Beyond mere practicality, refrigeration has become intertwined with the American perception of freshness. The sight of neatly arranged rows of chilled milk bottles evokes a sense of assurance a guarantee of quality and safety. For consumers accustomed to the instant gratification of modern life, the notion of room temperature milk may seem archaic, even unappetizing. In a culture that prizes convenience above all else, the appeal of cold milk is undeniable. Moreover, refrigeration plays a pivotal role in shaping consumer behavior and preferences. Studies have shown that colder temperatures can enhance the perceived freshness and taste of food and beverages a psychological trick that retailers and marketers leverage to their advantage. By prominently displaying refrigerated milk in well-lit temperature-controlled environments, retailers reinforce the association between coldness and quality, compelling consumers to reach for the chilled option without a second thought. In essence, the allure of refrigerated milk transcends mere practicality. It's a cultural phenomenon deeply ingrained in the American psyche. As long as refrigeration remains synonymous with freshness and modernity, the transition to alternative preservation methods like UHT pasteurization may face an uphill battle against deeply entrenched consumer perceptions. Green Milk Cold Stairs, the environmental case for UHT pasteurization. In the ongoing battle against climate change, every industry is under scrutiny for its environmental impact, and the dairy sector is no exception. As the world seeks greener alternatives to traditional practices, UHT, ultra-high temperature pasteurization, emerges as a promising solution a game-changer in the quest for sustainability within the dairy industry. Yet despite its potential to reduce carbon emissions and energy consumption, UHT pasteurization encounters resistance from a culture deeply rooted in the tradition of refrigerated milk. The environmental benefits of UHT pasteurization stem from its energy-efficient processing and extended shelf life at room temperature. Unlike conventional pasteurization methods, which require continuous refrigeration to maintain freshness, UHT-treated milk can be stored and transported without the need for cold storage, drastically reducing energy consumption throughout the supply chain. By eliminating the need for constant refrigeration, UHT pasteurization offers a tangible opportunity to shrink the dairy industry's carbon footprint and mitigate its environmental impact. Furthermore, UHT pasteurization presents a compelling solution to the pervasive issue of food waste, a significant contributor to greenhouse gas emissions. With its extended shelf life of several months, UHT-treated milk drastically reduces the likelihood of spoilage and expiration, minimizing the need for disposal and alleviating strain on landfills. By reducing the volume of wasted milk and the associated environmental costs of production and disposal, UHT pasteurization aligns with the principles of sustainability and resource efficiency. Despite its clear environmental advantages, UHT pasteurization faces resistance from consumers entrenched in the culture of refrigerated milk. The psychological association between coldness and freshness, perpetuated by decades of marketing and consumer conditioning, poses a formidable barrier to the widespread adoption of UHT-treated milk. 
Moreover, lingering doubts about taste and texture further compound consumer skepticism, fueling reluctance to embrace this environmentally friendly alternative. In conclusion, while UHT pasteurization holds immense promise for reducing the dairy industry's environmental impact, its success hinges on overcoming entrenched consumer perceptions and cultural resistance. As the world grapples with the urgent imperative of combating climate change, the adoption of UHT-treated milk represents a crucial step toward a more sustainable, greener future for the dairy industry and the planet as a whole. From Ice Age to Eco Age, Rethinking Refrigeration in the Dairy Isle The evolution of refrigeration in the dairy isle reflects not only technological advancements, but also shifting societal values and environmental awareness. Once hailed as a marvel of modern convenience, refrigeration now finds itself at the center of a growing environmental debate, one that challenges the status quo and calls for a re-evaluation of traditional preservation methods. As the world transitions from the ice age of excessive energy consumption to the eco age of sustainability, the time has come to rethink the role of refrigeration in the dairy industry. Refrigeration's ascent to prominence in the dairy aisle is a testament to humanity's ingenuity and desire for convenience. From the humble icebox to the sleek, energy-efficient refrigeration units of today, the journey of milk from farm to table has been marked by a relentless pursuit of freshness and quality. However, as concerns over climate change and resource depletion intensify, the environmental costs of refrigeration come under scrutiny, prompting a reassessment of its role in the dairy supply chain. Enter UHT Pasteurization, a technological innovation poised to disrupt the dairy industry's reliance on refrigeration. By eliminating the need for continuous cold storage, UHT Treated Milk offers a compelling alternative to traditional preservation methods, promising significant energy savings and reduced carbon emissions. Yet despite its environmental benefits, UHT Pasteurization faces resistance from consumers wedded to the idea of chilled milk a cultural preference deeply ingrained in the American psyche. The transition from refrigerated to room temperature milk represents more than just a change in consumer habits. It symbolizes a broader shift toward a more sustainable, eco-conscious future. As society grapples with the urgent imperative of reducing its environmental footprint, the dairy industry stands at a crossroads, poised to embrace innovation and embrace change. By rethinking the role of refrigeration in the dairy aisle, and embracing greener alternatives like UHT pasteurization, we can pave the way for a more sustainable, resilient food system, one that nourishes both people and the planet for generations to come.